I look like Donald Trump right now. Holding, we're holding, we're holding, holding, we're holding, we're holding. Thumbnail! Yes, I'm currently back naked. Hey, big spender! Hello there, and welcome back. Hi, I'm Misha, and it's currently Saturday morning, and I'm about to show you guys, oh, that I got an email. <laughs> my most requested video of late now i did one of these back like maybe like two years ago but it's so old now the color doesn't exist anymore and i think i've changed quite a bit so this is going to be a how i pin curl curl style my curly hair now that i've got my long hair back um i'm back into pin curling and doing really curly locks so that's what i'm going to show you uh yes so i'm going to show you every single shampoo conditioner spray protectant literally every single detail is going to be in this video so it's going to be rather in depth but as we can see i've got minging gross greasy hair right now and if you want to know why i've got green eyeshadow on i'm honestly not even sure we'll save that for another day it's only 11 30 on a saturday and i've got green eyeshadow but anyway i'm gonna get my little butt into the shower but first of all my butt butt <laughs> I'm gonna put in a leave-in conditioner mask just for like a few minutes before I get in and I'm gonna whack out my function of beauty mask now you can see I've been using this bad boy up but it's still got so much left in it and it just smells so good okay so function of beauty is actually a new brand to me but I've been so obsessed with them I've heard so much about them can't go over the smell of it every single time so first off this is the hair mask this is in the lilac -y color actually has my name on it i don't know if you guys can see that little detail where it says misha g it's just the cutest little thing and basically as a company they help you specialize what you would need for your hair so i think i actually still have the little sheet so they know that i have straight fine and normal hair because my natural hair type is that my goals are to protect the color deep condition hydrate replenish hair and strengthen and yeah so that is exactly what i've got i've got my little instructions for everything that i need to do but this is the leave-in mask i'm literally just going to grab some on my fingers Honestly, like, oh, I just got it on my nose. And then I'm just going to start to pop this down at the end. My hair is so dry, ATM, because I've been filming quite a lot. So I've been curling it and using different products. So it's time to revitalize it. I'm just doing it in, like, sections so that I can fully coat the hair. Um, because we want as much hydration as possible so that function know what hair type you have and like what your different goals are you actually complete like a little quiz which is actually really fun i'm not gonna lie um and you get to like pick your scent and pick the color pick the bottle like you get to do all of it so it's literally like a customized shampoo and conditioner which is just such a clever idea i'm gonna go wash my hands and i'm gonna put my hair up and i will see you in the minute in the shower lucky buggers hello and welcome to my shower now it's been a few minutes i have put my hair up so that the conditioner can soak in and yes i'm currently in my shower and yes i'm currently butt naked love that for me but okay so it's shower time now of course i am using my function of beauty shampoo and conditioner this sits pride of place in my shower and i don't know how but like I've been using it for a few weeks now and it doesn't look like I've barely touched it. Um, don't know how. But anyway, as you can see, I did go for the lilac colour because you guys know me. I absolutely love me some lilac. And I just love the packaging. It says like, unlike you, anybody, just for you. But I actually filmed the new shampoo and conditioners arrived because the package that it came in was so cute. It had stickers, it had a little leaflet. I had to film it before I ripped it to pieces just so I could show you guys because it's so adorable. But okay, I am literally going to start running the shower wash out this conditioner use the shampoo because honestly i have seen such a difference in my hair as someone who uses a lot of shampoos 
I find it really difficult to decide to stick with one, but honestly, I am so wholeheartedly obsessed. Because my Instagram stories are like my hair is just so much softer, so much smoother, but it still has loads of volume, and it just feels a lot more healthy. It also has no parabens, no sulfate, GMOs, or toxins, and is 100% cruelty-free and vegan, which I know is really important to a lot of you guys, and it's important to me as well, because even though I'm not vegan, it's really great to do the little bit that you can, even if it's buying products that are vegan-friendly. So, on that note, Let's get running this water and let's get using the shampoo and take off this green eyeshadow. Now, how do I do this without getting you wet? I'm just gonna, am I the only one that comes out of the shower to let it heat up? Because I am not getting in a cold shower. Yucky. Spend a little time with me. Oh my god, my hair feels so soft after the mask. Hey, big spender! <laughs> this is the most realistic representation of my life I have ever seen on the internet. Okay, we're going in with the shampoo. They also, oh my god, so they also, you can remove this top bit and put back on the metal cap it came with, and then you can bring them with you traveling, and it also has little mini squeezy tubes that you can put them in. How cute! Get in on in there, get in the nitty gritty, I look like the Joker. Okay, as I'm looking more and more crazy, time to condition. Who ever love a double condition? Just popping it on my ends. Whilst the condition is set, I'm just gonna have a bit of a wash. Okay guys, so as you're enjoying my shower footage, I just thought I'd let you know that if you click on the link below, you can get yourself a free hair mask, which is worth $19. Obviously, these beauties are from Function of Beauty, so make sure to click the link down below. Bye now. I'm just gonna use one of those makeup cloths to remove this face of makeup. Slightly less crazy. I'm going to wash this out, I'll see you downstairs. As in, not my downstairs, downstairs in my bedroom. Aya, hello there. And welcome to another episode of Misha being sexy. So, I'm creating a tripod out of miscellaneous objects around my home. But, okay, hair coming out of towel, still a bit damp. Um, I'm going to just remove the remainders of the Joker makeup that I have brewing on my face and I'm going to wipe it away. But now is the time to put some serums, some detanglers. Like, I have naturally very tangly hair, so no matter what shampoo or conditioner I use, I need to use a detangler. So the detangler that I've recently been using is the main and tail one. These are huge and really inexpensive, and G literally has about seven of them. Um, so you can literally coat your entire hair in it. Like, it doesn't make it greasy i avoid too much on the top half but you know you get the gist and then also i literally spoke about this so long ago i think it's like maybe like two or three years ago but this is the avon advanced techniques miracle den den densifier den densifier that's a hard word um so i just do a few little squidgies and i'm just gonna pop that through my hair um, and then I'm going to take this brush, which is the So Eco brush, and just attempt to comb through my hair. I don't know if I have my wet brush. Uh, there we go. I've got my wet brush. That's probably a better comb to use because it's specifically designed for wet hair. So... Yeah, I'm literally just gonna comb this through. I will be blow drying my hair. Now, it depends how much time I have, what I'm doing, what's going on, on whether I blow dry my hair or I let it air dry. But today, I'm probably gonna do some of it blow dried and then let the remainder air dry. Now, I'm gonna take some of this, which is the Bedhead TGI, TG, did I say T-I-G-I? 
don't know, blowout. And I'm just gonna pop this through the ends of my hair again. Just because I like it to be extra smooth. Yeah, la 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 la. Fa la 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 la. I'm not gonna lie, this hairstyle, like if you're gonna wash it on the day, it does take quite a while. Like I'm not gonna pretend. It's not like a five minute hair tutorial, but it is worth it and they last for days if you don't get your hair wet. <laughs> So it's now finally time to start the pin curling. As we can see, it's quite a process. So my hair is all dry. I've got a scrunchie and I'm just going to, oh, I've also put makeup on. Hi, I've got this cute little jumper on from Fashion Nova. I'm just gonna section off my hair. When I curl my hair normally, I don't really bother doing this. For some reason I did it when I had short hair, but when I've got long hair, it's just like too much effort. Yikes, there we go. There we go, I'm just gonna plop this a little bit. Now what I normally do is like tie this like that and then by the time I take it down it's got a huge kink. So actually I need to be a bit more sensible and I'm gonna twizzle it into a little bun and then I'll loosely put the scrunchie and that should be fine. Now as we can see I look very attractive during this. So I've got lots of goodies to talk you through that I use along the way. So first up, my hair curler. Now this hair curler, I'm not gonna lie, it's quite expensive. I did an ad for it literally donkeys ago and it is my favorite hair curler I've ever like led my, lay my hair. You guys know what I mean. So this is the Bombay hair curler. I think it's like around like the 180 mark, maybe more. Let's Google it and have a look do you think this is worth paying a bit extra because like this is gonna last me forever it's been at least a year since i did an ad for this um and it's such good quality and it's really light so it's good for traveling and this is the i think this is a 25 millimeter bombay gold curling wand that's 119 pounds but like chloe wanted to buy this curler because she likes it that much now before i actually start curling i'm going to do something which i don't always remember to do but i definitely should and that's put some heat protectant i use whatever one i randomly come across this one is the mark hill one i don't really have like a favorite heat protectant um and i'm just gonna spritz it on and then comb through my hair again. I've literally been obsessed. Oh, wow, wow, all that hair, lovely. I've been obsessed with this brush, which is from So Eco. Um, it's really like, oh, I just really like it. I just really, really like it. So I'm just gonna comb all that through. Then I actually bought some brand new, like Kirby grips, whatever the hell you wanna call these, hair slides, hair pins. I'm not even sure, there's so many different terms. Um, these are just Boots ones because I feel like every single time I use them, I lose them. If I'm just like going out and like doing this during the day and not sleeping in them, I'll use the metal pins you can get from Sally's. Um, but I've kind of just got used to using these ones now, so I just use that over it because it's a little bit, I don't know. The metal ones can get a little bit like heavy on your head. Um, with the pin curling, you can either pin it and then sleep in them, or you can just leave it in for an hour or so, or three, or a day. Say you did it in the morning, and then you were going out in the evening, and you just took them out just before. Um, it kind of has a similar effect. Sometimes I think when I sleep in it, it's almost too curly. So I'm going to grab a section of like of that size. You can see my wefts here. Um, where they've been put in and then my hair's naturally grown. So next time I go to the hairdressers, they'll get taken out and readjusted closer to my scalp. So, I am no expert. I don't know which direction it should be in. I don't know which way I'm supposed to hold the curler. What I say to mum is, I just curl hair. She's always like, yeah, but where does my hand need to be? Which one? I'm like, I don't know. I just curl hair. My hands just do what my hands do. Um, and I never really know like how long to say to hold it for because I just kind of hold it and then decide that I'm done. And then we drop it. And that is what this bad boy looks like. Now, if you just wanted like loose waves or you weren't bothered about pin curling, obviously you could just leave that curl down. But the reason 
we pin curl is because this makes your hair set so like if i pin curl my hair it lasts for like four or five days um so i i should probably do this a bit slower and a bit closer up so as you can see it's here and we want to set it in the curled position so i grab two fingers i put it underneath and i wrap it round so it's like a little circle can you see there's a gap in it and then i'm just gonna twizzle it i'm gonna grab a bobby pin i'm just gonna clip it at the base to my scalp and there we go then we move on and we do the exact same thing to the next piece holdy 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 spinny 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 and you don't need to worry too much about like getting the exact edge of the curl because when you like roll it up in a pin when it deheats the heat is also going to go on that bit and make it curly do you know what i mean so the reason you pin curl it is so that when it sets and the heat disappears that's definitely not the technical term um the hair almost remembers to be curly because that's how it's been set so as we can see beautiful curl stunning lovely two fingers Rappy, rappy, rappy. Sometimes this can get quite warm because this curler is on 230 degrees, which is quite warm. So be careful to like when you're wrapping it around your fingers not to accidentally burn them. Um, and then we do the exact same thing. And we pin to. Oh, oh, see, that's when I haven't put the pin in the right place. And then I'll just double pin because I'm like, you know. The more pins, the merrier. And then I normally end up finding pins in my head like three weeks later, which is great. Um, is it happy? I think it's happy. I know that's going like downwards, but we get the gist. I am no, okay, no, this one is not happy. This one is not happy. Let's <laughs> readjust. Can we see though, like, it's just a bit of trial and error. I am no hair expert. I have absolutely no clue. I think I've just picked this up from pageants, really. Like, I've picked it up along the way. Let's try again. It's because I didn't have a good enough bit of scalp to pin it to. So it was kind of just to my neck. There we go. Brilliant. Okay, now, please excuse my roots at the back. But I'm going to spin around so you can see me doing it. But I can't spin around on my actual chair because otherwise you won't be able to see the hair because my chair's got a high back so grabbing a sectione this is quite hard multitasking obviously i also don't have a mirror in this direction wrapping 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 we're holding we're holding we're holding okay first layer completed i'm gonna go in with this bad boy this is the mark hill freeze hold extreme hairspray this is a great hairspray and i'm just gonna spray it around i think i need to clean the nozzle though like you know with hairspray nozzles they get like really like gunky okay so now we are going to take down this bit. <laughs> wow this is really bad and maybe i shouldn't say this on the internet but i look like donald trump right now Take those a good or bad thing, but I did. Okay, so now we've got this bit up here. I'm gonna give it another brush through. And this is where <laughs> I always look crazy, like absolutely crazy, crazy. Like, look at this. What is this do right now? I've got some long bits, some short bits. I also look like I haven't curled any of my hair, which is great. Oh, I've got another. <laughs> so okay i'm just gonna brush through all of this i'm gonna do a middle parting but you can do whatever you fancy and then sexy i'm gonna grab oh wait don't forget the heat protectant not gonna lie not a huge fan of this heat protectant it's very like you know when the nozzle is like thick gel like it's not like a light mist um that's fine i do really like the lee stafford heat protectant and actually speaking of that 
look how cute this is that arrived oh my god this would be such a good christmas present i've just realized um this is the lee stafford anti-humidity spray hair goals on the go and it's like got a hairspray a dehumidifier don't know what the hell that is a dry shampoo and a shine spray cute eight pound fifty from boots fab but i don't want to use them now because i want to save them for when i go traveling so okay around the face grab a piece now i like my baby hairs aren't long enough to like get in my curling so i'm just kind of like they're there we get over it we, we we don't really care that much and i just go like so these are slightly smaller pieces because this is my natural hair so it's a bit thinner than my extension um so these ones are more curly but that's actually not a bad thing because natural hair typically doesn't hold curls as well so it's better that it's curlier also can we see that then i managed to just slide the curler out and then you don't have to do all the finger winding because it's still in the shape and then i'm gonna do the exact same thing i do think the more and more you do this the quicker you get because it really is not taking me very long to like i was two minutes into a youtube video and now i've got i'm now eight minutes so it's taken me six minutes to do the bottom half of my head and then this bit is also quicker because there's less hair but now you can watch me sped up doing the exact same thing see you when all my pins are in hello ha there hi i'm misha and i'm from the 60s with my pin curls so they are all in we're gonna have one vinyl display and now i'm really gonna leave these for just like an hour because i need to head out and you guys can see what it looks like when they've cooled down like even the bottom ones if you feel the bottom ones in comparison to the top ones that i've just done these are much warmer rather rather in comparison to the bottom ones but yeah i'm just gonna go around the house busy myself sort my life out and i'll be back in like an hour and we can see what my hair is looking like woohoo because i also want to show you guys like me styling it bye now oh uh, hello misha is back and now she looks like a tudor but okay obviously i've been busy so things have started to drop a little bit but it's not the end of the world now i'm just going to go through the annoying bit which is taking out and trying to find all the pins but can we see how beautiful that curl is looking start at the bottom because if you start at the top you are never ever gonna find the pins um but you basically just have to ferret around stick your hands in and just pull them out but they have absolutely no heat on them right now like they aren't at all warm they have completely set <gasps> these curls are looking stunning now i don't do this like every single time i curl my hair but if i've got like a special occasion i just want to put a little bit more effort into my hair this is what i will do that's what they're looking like without being brushed and also this hairspray it's like good because it doesn't make your hair feel really like sticky and tacky but it still holds them like i feel like some hairsprays try and avoid being tacky that they don't they're not like strong enough to actually do anything um which kind of obviously defeats the point of hairspray okay so also my extensions are beauty works um wefts and i'll link them down below because i know i seem to get a lot of questions about them recently so yeah my hair is naturally well not naturally i cut it all off like that's the length of my hair and then obviously there's all this down here um so I'm currently going to look a bit crazy because these have just come out. Can we see? These make me laugh because it always look like I have horns. But now what I do is I could use my Eco Tools brush. I could, I basically just use like any brush that's got like bristles so that it's not like frizzy. And then see this one i don't think i'm gonna buy i think this in the fake plastic is gonna be better so i just brush at the curls i will fix bits in a second 
<laughs> my hair is actually huge and genuinely it's because of that shampoo and conditioner it gives it so much volume okay now typically when i actually do my hair like this i don't wear it in the middle parting um so then i like flip my hair to the side sort out my fringe I quite like a sweeping fringe. Wow! This is looking great! Okay, so what we're now gonna do, I'm gonna grab some more hair oil. Now I'm gonna show you this one, which is the Elvive L'Oreal Extraordinary Oil. And I never know how much to put because I've always obviously got used to doing my short hair. And I'm just gonna take this through the ends just to get rid of any frizz but fair play Mish this hair is looking great now obviously it is quite curly but like the more you brush it and the more you leave it they will drop a little bit but you're better off starting with them reasonably curly um and then that's what it looks like at the back now obviously you can spray a little bit more hairspray particularly around the fringe, just to keep it locked in. But there we go. Now, me being me, I'm gonna need to top it off with a little something something. Of course, that little something something is a Picanita X Misha Grimes headband. This is the Misha headband. And I just think, you know, why not wear a hair accessory? I will link my whole Picanita X Misha Grimes collection down below. And yeah, I can just keep on combing and just softening out those curls. But beautiful. Also, if you wanted to, you could obviously get rid of the fringe and push it back and then just have these curls. I'm going to do a little IGTV styling video of like how to wear my headbands and everything like that um, because I feel like there's so many ways that you guys may not even think of but also because my hair has so much volume I can like change which side I want on which side do you guys prefer my fringe do you prefer it this way do you prefer it that way because we pin like I can do a lot to this and it's not going to drop it's not going to lose its shape um, which is obviously very useful. So, that is me done and dusted. And I'd love to pretend I'm actually going out and doing anything right now, but I'm not. I'm going to go get in bed and edit this video. So I've now got great hair for absolutely no reason. But you guys got to learn how I pin curl my hair. So that is the reason. Um, and it will still be good for tomorrow. What I'll do is when I go to sleep... I will brush it up into a bun and then I'll grab it and I'll like twizzle it in the direction that the curls are and then I'll loosely put a scrunchie and I'll sleep in it like that and it will pretty much look like a BTEC version of what it does right now. Um, oh, I think I need to comb it through again. <laughs> Gone a bit crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. But yes. So, that is exactly how to pin curl your hair with Misha Grimes. I hope you guys have enjoyed. I hope you found it somewhat informative. As I said, I am no hair expert, but I know what I know and I want to share with you guys. So on that note, I'm gonna love you and leave you. I will link everything that I can down below that I have used and shown you guys. But yes, make sure to do a like and subscribe. Let me know if you're excited for Christmas because me and Coves have just discussed we're gonna put up the Christmas tree on Sunday in my bedroom we just need to figure out where it's gonna go because there's currently no space because i've put more furniture in here since last year but we're gonna go with it it'll be fine could i almost like move over by where I... I don't know we'll figure it out but yes we're gonna film that so stay tuned to see that but i'm gonna love you leave you all and this jumper is from fashion nova so a toodle pip i love you guys a lot and i will see you in the next video bye guys Mwah.